Hello, I am Dr. Young Seok Lim, a professor at Asap Medical Center, University of Ulsan College of Medicine, Seoul, Korea. I will briefly introduce our study results that is being published in GUT. High serum hepatitis B virus DNA levels are associated with high risk of hepatocellular carcinoma, HCC, and the disease progression in chronic hepatitis B patients irrespective of serum ART levels. Although the immune tolerant phase is characterized by high circulating HPV DNA levels, it remains unknown whether antiviral treatment in these patients would reduce risk of HCC and mortality. Therefore, we compared the long-term outcomes of untreated immune tolerant phase patients with those of treated immune active phase patients. This historical cohort study included HBE antigen positive chronic hepatitis B patients with high HBV DNA levels and no evidence of cirrhosis at Assam Medical Center, Seoul, Korea from 2000 to 2013. ART levels were defined as normal according to the criteria of the American Association for the Study of Liver Disease 19 units per liter for females and 30 units per liter for males. A total of 413 untreated immune tolerant phase patients with normal ART and 1,497 immune active phase patients treated with oral antiviral agents comprised the study cohorts. At baseline, the immune tolerant group was significantly younger and had significantly higher levels of albumin and platelet counts than the immune active group. The 10-year estimated cumulative instance of HCC was 13% in the untreated immune tolerant phase group, which was significantly higher of 6% in the treated immune active phase group. The cumulative instance of death or transplantation was also significantly higher in the untreated immune tolerant phase group than in the treated immune active phase group. The higher risk of HCC and death or transplantation in the untreated immune tolerant group compared with the treated immune active group was consistently identified by multivariable analysis and also by propensity score matched analysis as shown in these slides. Among the 1,554 untreated patients in the immune tolerant and mild reactive phase patients, old age, male gender, lower HBV DNA levels, and the lower platelet counts were independently associated with a significantly higher risk of clinical events. In conclusion, the present cohort study showed that the untreated immune tolerant phase patients had a significantly higher risk of HCC and death or transplantation than the treated immune active phase patients. Our study results suggest that many unnecessary deaths could be prevented by earlier antiviral intervention in the immune tolerant phase patients before the appearance of clinically active liver disease.